So just 15 minutes ago, after a two-hour long meeting with Malikarjun Kharge, DK Shivkumar made his way out. And let's get you the inside word of what we're picking up from those huddles. DK Shivkumar is digging in his heels and how. Reportedly, and this is the information we're picking up, DK Shivkumar is quite simply not willing to budge on the CM demand. He's saying even if you want to make it rotational, and this is a compromise that he's coming up with, saying if not full term, even if you're making it split between the two of us, between me and Sidramaya, I want to serve as the chief minister first. Give me the first two years and then give Sidramaya the rest of the tenure. That's the big breaking news that's coming in right now. So now it's back to square one. The high command comes to our huddle, figures out whether this is a compromise that works for them. Will they make DK Shukumar the chief minister first and then Sidramaya? That is something that remains to be seen. Nagarjun Dwarkanath is getting us the inside track on that. Nagarjun, what's delayed the decision uh, of Sidramaya being named as the chief minister is DK Shivkumar being extremely stubborn. You know, you mentioned that both Sidramaya and DK Shivkumar are men who are very clear in and, and set in their ways. They say, my way or the highway. And this is DK Shivkumar essentially establishing that. He's okay with rotational CM, so that's at least a slight breakthrough. But he says, me, I have to be the CM first. Well, Akshita, even the part that if he's okay to be the first half of the CM and share the uh, tenure, that's also a big if. This point of time, as I speak to you, few minutes before I spoke to closest, uh, sources close to DK Shivkumar as well and sources close to the Congress president uh, as well, it's a deadlock as of now. Both the Netas are saying that they want the first half if uh, a, a, a pact is reached between these two. Uh, and then also High Command feels that it should not be a one-man show, so no person can take oath alone. There needs to be a council of ministers also to take oath. It won't send a good message that equally everyone has worked hard, not just one person, not just Sidramay or DK Shivkumar. A booth-level karyakarta to the uh, topmost leader, all of them have worked together and hence a uh, council of ministers around 8 to 10 plus the chief minister taking oath would take, send a good message or a strong message <coughs> to the people, thanking them because they have given a strong mandate. And second issue is, Mr. Shiv Kumar is very adamant. He's saying that nothing less than Chief Minister I want. Because uh, the High Command felt that Sidramaya would be the Chief Minister and the message was communicated to Mr. Sidramaya, the DPAR uh, locally had been on standby and they had started doing the preparation. And remember, the DPAR is a government body. So when they started doing preparation, all the media houses, including the fan fans and supporters of Sidramaya started celebrating. Uh, the media houses then said that Sidramaya would be the chief minister. Uh, but the negotiation stopped when Mr. Shiv Kumar said, I don't want anything else apart from the chief minister post. Even if hypothetically say I agree to a pact sharing or a tenure sharing, I want to be the first, uh, first half of the tenure. I don't